What's the story? It went through down there. It must have hit pretty hard. It was high tide at one last night, and, and no one around here saw anything. Broken neck seems to be the cause of death. What about that bruise? Looks like someone hit him while he was alive. I'd say suicide. He plowed an awfully straight furrow down the pier. We don't suspect foul play. You know the man, Marlowe? The Sternwood chauffeur. I saw him polishing the car yesterday. Hmm. Did your job for the general have anything to do with him? Not at all. I don't even know his name. Owen Taylor. Hmm? Yes, that's his name. About two years ago, the general called me. Taylor had run off with that crazy daughter, the young one. I helped trace them. They were in Scotland where you can get married quickly. And? Well, next day, the older sister comes down and says that Taylor was gaga over her sister Camilla. And she put him up to the marriage thing. In the meantime, we checked. Found he'd done six months for robbery a few years earlier. Screwy family. I guess now you got to go against them, huh? I'll have to ask them some questions. Well, try to leave the old man out of it if you can. Huh? Why? Well, he's got enough trouble. And besides, he's sick. You mean he pines for his dear lost friend, Rusty Regan? Look, I know nothing about Rusty Regan. Regan hasn't harmed anybody that I know of. I'm not looking for Regan. <laughs> 